Everything is in the name of content. Here we go. 66. 67. Wow. It's like a slash Elder Mole weapon. 164 slash. Crush is 167. It's an Elder Mole for slash, basically. Let me get the amulet, actually. All right, guys. We're going to be the first ones we came with this weapon. Here we go. You can hit a 67. With Elder Mole, you can hit a 68. Okay. It's a two strength bonus difference. Let me just check one more thing before we go PK with it. Because there's a trick that you can use and get 119 strength. And I want to see if this Rancor will give you a max hit if you use this weapon. The thing about the Halibird is that can be used for NHing is that you don't have to be on this tile to hit. So let's say that you're in NHing and you guys are one tile away from each other. I can just randomly pull out the thing and just go like this. And hit a 67 from two tiles away. I mean, I think it can be useful. Ooh, 69 Elder with the plus one. Zeal, zeal. 50-50, 52, 52, wait, I'm pretty sure it's 51 with 118 strength. If I hit an 80 Void Waker, I get a max hit. <laughs> let me see, let me see if I lose a max hit. Right now, I'm 119, wait. I'm 118 now, let's see. Wow. Wait, let me see, torture. Yeah, bro, the rank card gives two max hits. Wow, the Rancor gives two max hits for Void Waker. Let me see AGS. The Oki, yes, sir. 88! The Oki, yes, sir. Oh, you can hit one more max hit. One more max hit with the thing. How about DDS? Zeal, zeal. 50 50, same shit. Gmo's 51 with torture. Rancor gives a max hit on certain weapons. So it gives a max hit on AGS, two max hit on Void Waker, one max hit on Gmo. Let me see, does it give a max hit on Elder? 68 with torture. 68. 67 with Halibur. Let me see. 67 still. 45, 22, 67, 79, 90. You can hit a 90 claw. How about with this? Claw didn't change. Claw is still 90. It's always been 90. All right, so I can hit an 88 AGS. I can hit an 81 Void Waker. I can hit a 52 G Mall. 